Hi everybody. In this video, I will sharing a useful tip to you all. If you want to arrange multiple image into Microsoft Excel or Microsoft Word memory, you need to open file, insert image, resize, name the image name one by one. If you have many image, it will be time consuming. It may take you many days to complete the task. Here, I'm sharing you how I use VBA script to automatically rearrange my data and my image into Excel or in Microsoft Word. Here, I will teach you step by step. Okay, here is the place to write your script. We name the function as insert jpg file. This script only for one image. File name is a string variable where you store your image. Active ship picture insert is a function to insert image. And then the file name should be same. Insert file name, file name. Okay, the cells that you want to put in your image, for example, we put A2, A2, active sheets dot range, A2 to the left and to the top. Now we run our program. Here, the program is A2 over here, A is the column and 2 is the row. So, what happens if we change to A1 and A1? Okay, now the result of A1, A1, here should be A1, A1, and then we now we change to A2 and A2. So here there are a double image here if we didn't delete it. Okay, let's try if we have our uh, different locations. We're putting A9 and A2. So the result is uh, not coming out. The image is not coming out. That means that you should be put the same way. Remember to put the same because they are in the same cells. So there's nothing here. If we change back to A9 and A9, so the image is coming out. Okay, now we're trying to drag it to fit the image. Okay, we try again with the uh, VBA script. So the result now is whatever we want it. Okay, so now we delete all our image. Actually, later I will teach you how you're using coding to delete all of them. So you no need to delete yourself. So now we need to insert our first step that we need to change our code to make it automatically. So the J's is for column and I's is for row. Okay, and then uh, how we want to insert the names of the file automatically, we put the cells dot value equal to what 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 image you want, what it, what the description you want to put inside. So here I want to put uh, the file names. So I put two thousand plus num dot jpg. So this is b two b two the place that we haven't changed it. So every of our image will be insert into B2 so now the image is only insert uh, into B2 the others is empty so how we want to do to make all of them become insert big 
image automatically. We don't need to uh, change one by one to make it. So here, you see, I need to do one by one. That is very tedious and very stupid work. So we need to understand the C4 and where it will be uh, appeals. Okay, we try to copy paste our image into words file. Okay, you should be choose the fourth one. Because my uh, laptop a bit lag, so it has a problem of it. So I redo it by uh, paste it with the icon number 4. Okay, I'm right click it. Uh, you need to highlight them first before you want to uh, paste them. Okay, right click and then you uh, press the fourth one so the image is arranged automatically in your uh, Microsoft Word. So you can see this column, these two lines of the code is set the width and the height for each cell. Okay, the first one you want to adjust the columns width, adjust the table columns into 13, and then uh, the row height. You want to adjust the table rows high. Okay, it's one until eight, and then the column is A until H. So now we're testing for um, how much? Okay, eight B. The array you can ignore it because it's not enough for the image, is not enough eight times seven. So it sells they will have the same high. Now we change to 55. Ignore the arrow. Okay, now you can see uh, the range of dense should be uh, the same 50, 55. Okay, here this this automatically file. So your file name should be in sequence. So the file names what I want to use now is two one one four. Okay, so total have fifty two item. So fifty two item you should be uh in seven eight fifty six should be fit enough for your image. So now you look at the file name is two one one four. So for this you put 2113 so the next will be 2114 okay now the results is coming out 2114 okay okay now you put 2113 and then this one you need to change to folders 14 okay same here you can just click here and then you copy paste to be here and then your file name should be in sequence. This is for Excel's column. So letter you will be A1, A2, A3, B1, B2, B3 so you can bake it in automatically. Here is the place that we put.
okay this this uh, line of columns is to delete and then this one is to automatically loading loading for the the location okay the cells that you want to put your image in this one column plus column one is will be add automatically okay here our image is one one four okay it's automatically coming out it's done I will show you the coding behind of my video so you can just if you want to want the code directly you can just skip to the end of the in uh, at the end of my video this is here my result so I can just do it in a second Okay, this is my uh, whole codings here. This is the base one. Okay. This one is uh, only the parameter that we want to use. Thank you for watching my video. If you like my video, please subscribe my channel. Having fun in coding. This is page 2, the last page of my coding. See you again in my next tutorial. Bye-bye.